1994, after 20 years of forced exile in the West, Alexander Solzhenitsyn returned to Russia. At one town meeting held on his Trans-Siberian whistle-stop tour to reacquaint himself with his homeland, he was confronted by this rebuke. It is you and your writing that started it all and brought our country to the verge of collapse and devastation. Russia doesn't need you, so go back to your blessed America. Solzhenitsyn instantly replied that to his dying day he would keep fighting against the evil ideology that was capable of slaying one-third of his country's population. The meeting erupted in applause. That sort of exchange was unimaginable when the present abridgment of the Gulag Archipelago first appeared in 1985. Almost no one expected then that within a few years the Soviet Union would collapse, and almost in a day, like the legendary one-horse Shea. 